Welcome back to Shark Games. Today I will be showing you guys how you can easily create a third person shooter controller in Unity using Unity's built in third person controller examples. When you're in the Unity Hub, click on New Project in the top right corner. Now scroll down until you find third person and then download the example project. Once it's downloaded, you need to give your project a name. For example, third person shooter and then press Create Project. Once your project has been created, you're pretty much done already. You can just press play and immediately move around, run and jump. But this is already really useful, there are some things to change to make it even better. First of all, select the player armature. This is where all the scripting is done to get the player moving in the way it does. Personally, I think the mouse sensitivity is way too slow. Unfortunately, there is no way to change it right now, so let's add that. Open the third person controller script. Go right below the lock camera position variable, create a public vector2 called look sensitivity. This will be the mouse sensitivity. Now search for cinema machine target draw plus equals input.look.x multiplied by the delta time multiplier. This is the current way that the camera has moved. To add our custom sensitivity variable, simply add multiplied by look sensitivity.x and then in the line below that multiply by look sensitivity.y. Now go back into Unity. You can use any value you want for the look sensitivity. I like to put it at 5 and 5. If you now press play, you can see the camera is way faster and moves just way smoother. Next up, I'll add a model for the player. Go to mixamo.com and log in. This is a great website created by a Adobe where you can find free models and animations which you can use in your games. I'll just go to characters and find one which I like. I think the SWAT guy is pretty cool. Press download. Change format to FBX for Unity and make sure the pose is in T-Pose. Then press download. Once it's downloaded, drag and drop the model into Unity. I have the separate models folder where I'll put it in. Click on the asset, change the animation clip name from Mixamo.com to T-Pose, then go to Rig and change the animation type to Humanoid. Press apply. There's an issue with this model. There are no textures on it. To fix this, go to materials and press extract textures. Choose a location for the textures and press confirm. The model now has its textures. Now go to the player armature object. Right click on it. Go to the prefab and unpack completely. Now go to the geometry and remove the armature mesh. Place our new model in there. Remove the animator component from this object. Now go to the player armature and change the animator avatar to our new avatar. Press play and test it out. There you go, you now have a fully functional third person controller in Unity. If you enjoyed this video, please consider liking and subscribing, since this really helps me out. Anyway, I'll see you guys in the next one.